The third phase in the ITIL service life cycle is service transition. It is in this stage in which an IT service must plan and manage changes efficiently and effectively. This module helps to outline how that goes into effect and explains several objectives IT management must take into account if they hope to adhere to potential changes during the life cycle. This means IT services need to manage risks relating to new, changed, or retired services and successfully deploy service releases into supported environments, provide good quality knowledge and information about these services and its accompanying assets, and ensure those services create the expected business value, just to name a few. In addition to these aforementioned methodologies, this course also will cover material that will help you define and detail the key concepts of service transition, state the purpose, scope, and objectives of release and deploy, service asset and configuration and knowledge management, as well as transition planning and support. By the end of this course, you should also have enough knowledge to understand how service transition contributes to the ITIL service lifecycle. For more information and courses regarding our ITIL training, visit us at LearnSmartSystems.com.